one of the hardest shots in tennis is that high backhand. What do you do with that backhand is the real question. Do you step back? Do you step in? Try to get it on the rise or let it drop? So this first one is what you want to do. You want to get your arms extended out in front of you. Get the ball about, I'd say about a 30 degree angle from your body relative to the net. And you want to make sure that you get your body weight behind it. Check it out. I'll show you that one again. Now you can see that on that last shot, I made sure to get a little bit of a jump as well. So that jump is important because it allows you to utilize your whole body into the shot. Because if you notice, if you don't jump, you're going to be extending really high up in the air. And it's going to be hard to get your whole body moving in one um, momentum. Now, these next couple are what you do not want to be doing. You don't want to, I'm going to do everything the complete opposite. I'm not going to extend my legs or my arm, and I'm not going to move my body into the shot. In those last two, there was no momentum, no power, and no drive, which is the complete opposite of what I did on the first couple. If you could implement those two tips, making sure to extend your arm, as well as getting your body behind that shot with maybe a little bit of jump as well. Depends on what you feel comfortable with as well as high, how high the ball is. This is gonna improve your high backhand. This takes a lot of work. This is a very difficult shot. It's one of the most difficult shots in the game. So it'll take a lot of practice. Hope you guys enjoyed and if it added some value to your game, leave a like and subscribe and leave a comment down below for other tips you'd like to see. Have a great day guys.